Hello guys, Major Colton here, and today I'm going to be playing a game called, known as Strike Suit. Uh, let me see, Strike Suit Infinity. I was want to say Strike Suit Zero, but that's the other one. But basically, this one's like the game Strike Suit Infinity, but it's basically an endless horde kind of thing, round wise. And I'm thinking of doing a series over it. And just to be noted, I am using some mods on it. That way I can stay in, pretty much stay in the robot mode as long as I want. Because, hey, I'm a fan of robot kind of games. Not, And I'm playing this game because of the strike suit mode, not because of the jet fighting mode. So, your experience would be a little bit different from mine. So, let's get to it. Plus, I do it because it'll make the video, me playing it a lot cooler. And it's my game, I can play it how I want. <laughs> Especially since it's single player. Don't have these guys yet, apparently. Okay. Yeah, I just got this game last night, by the way. It's on Steam for, I think, about six or seven dollars. So if you actually liked it, liked watching it, you can always go out and get it yourself and then ask me how I, how I altered it so I had basic, basically infinite stuff. Didn't do the score mods because I actually want to get the score. I just wanted to make it so I can play the game consistently in the strike suit mode. It's the only thing. Because in that aspect, for all my uh, Armored Core fans on my channel, pretty much makes this game a like Armored Core for Answer in space. It's pretty much what it is, is Armored Core for Answer in space now. Now after the stuff I've done to it. But as you can see, normally you would like stay in this little pilot mode right here. But, I decided to take the next step. It says there's some enemies incoming. Oh, there they are. Still not used to the controls altogether too well yet, because one mode's inverted, one's not, so... Like, this mode right here I'm in right now, the strike suit is inverted, and I just don't feel like messing around with the settings. <coughs> Ooh, I moved a little bit too fast. Also, I have infinite thrust as to... And the reason why I put that on... First, I'll put the infinite flux on so I can stay in the robot mode. Then I put infinite thrust on to make the game like Armored Core for Answer, pretty much. So basically, I'm playing like Armored Core in space right now, and we all know it's going to get there at one point. Yeah, that's a capital ship, it looks like, maybe. Oh no, it's not, it's too small. just meant well guys it looks like I'm done with round one so I'm gonna do like the many part a bunch of part series at least one per video per round then maybe some highlights if I go get into some crazy fights 
Uh, I got de in the last two because I'm not used to the game yet. Hopefully by the next few ones I'll have a, new, a better, faster strike suit because it said there's two others I could buy. And by the way, also you can call in reinforcements pretty much if you wanted to. Not sure how you exactly do call them in, but I'm not gonna buy any because I want to do all the fighting. But yeah guys, that was round one, and then stay tuned for round two of me playing pretty much Armor Core for Answer in Space, but it is Strike Suit Infinity. Like I said, it's on Steam for just a handful of dollars, buy a couple candy bars for the same amount, so I think it's a very good buy, especially if you plan on modding the hell out of it like I have. So, all in all... I hope you, I'll see you guys in the next video. If you like the video, comment, like, subscribe. If you want to know how I made everything pretty much where I had Mac of Infinite of all the stuff so you could have a setup running kind of like I had, just ask me in the comment section below. But all in all, I'll see you in the next video.